You know, folks, I just typed sports, internet, and urban economics in Google to, and then took a look at studies, hoping that I'd find one study that represented the impact of the internet on urban economics and sports. I found nothing. So let me tell you this. These studies that purport to estimate the economic impact of sports teams on cities are garbage because they don't take into account the impact of the internet and social media and how fans follow that team and that impact on the sports urban economy of the city that that team is headed to. Nothing at all. I mean, I saw one study here that said that, well, we didn't find, this is by Andrew Renzimbalist, who I know. So, well, he was actually on my board when I started Sports Business Simulations. It said, well, we didn't find any net increase in businesses after new stadium op openings. But then he writes, we did find an increase in employment around the stadium. Well, if you'd found that, that automatically implies new businesses, not necessarily the same business adding more people. But he wrote that contradictory take in one paragraph. Okay? So there's a lot of ridiculous idiocy. I'm saying just like that. Sorry, Andy, I like you a lot. But that was ridiculous. That's out there. And then the media, which doesn't know any better, quotes it without any ounce of critical thinking at all. Subscribe to Zenny62 and bookmark localnewsnowblog.com.